Hallelujah, hallelujah. This is a day that the Lord has made, and I will rejoice and be glad in it. Praise God, hallelujah. Hallelujah. <clears throat> hallelujah. So I am I've been praying with these this group in the mornings and this is our prayer focus is transforming the renewal Romans 12 1 and 2 but be ye transformed hallelujah Hallelujah, Lord God, I give you praise. I give you praise. I thank you, Lord God, for your goodness and your mercies. There is none like you in all the earth, in all the world, Lord God. There is nothing and no one greater than you. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Lord God, I give you praise. I thank you for your glory. I thank you for your goodness, Lord God. Father God, touch each and every one's life. Under the sound of my voice, Father, Father, renew us, restore us, refresh us. May we never be as we were before, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Now, Lord God, we ask for forgiveness of our sins. Cleanse us of all unrighteousness and create in us a clean heart and renew a right spirit within us, Father. Father, we also say that we forgive those who have done us wrong, those who've sinned against us, prayed against us, those who had ill wishes against us, those who set up evil altars against us, Lord God, we forgive them. Father, we place them in your hand. You said, vengeance is mine and I will repay, says the Lord. So <clears throat> we put those people and those situations in your hands. And Lord God, we live in the here and now. Hallelujah. And we live, Lord God, and walk by the spirit of the living God. We thank you, Lord God. Transform us. Transform us. Change us, Lord God, that we will be more like you. Hallelujah. Our heart, hallelujah, our heart is... um in the process of changing and I decree and declare that we are aligned with God's perfect will for our life. Lord, we surrender our process. We surrender our transformative process. We surrendered, Lord God, uh, transforming into your image. We surrender, Lord God. We are not our own, but we are bought at a price in the name of Jesus. And we are bought by the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Father, transform us into vessels that reflect your purity and your righteousness. Transform our desires so that we are eager to live according to your purpose purpose, Lord God. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. May we be eager to do the things of God. May we be eager to walk in kingdom power and kingdom might and kingdom authority in the mighty name of Jesus. I decree and declare that we are set free from the bondage of worldly influences. I decree and declare, hallelujah, that our eyes are not watching the television more than we're reading God's word. I decree and declare that our eyes aren't watching other things. Things that aren't good for our eyes over uh, reading God's word. Hallelujah. We're not on social media more than we're reading God's word. Hallelujah. Even our ears, Lord God, may our ears be consecrated before the Lord. May we be careful what we hear. May we be careful what we listen to. May we be careful the language and the, the, um, literature that we're reading and the language that we're listening to, Lord God, whether it's in conversation, whether it's on television, whether it's on uh, radio or, or however people are listening to music nowadays. They're listening to their iPods. They're listening to their Apple Pay or their Apple uh, uh, Music. They're listening to all these different um, avenues of of um, radio um, um 
transform lord god transform us lord god out of the ways of this world and may we not be in bondage by those things you know i see people walking around all the time with their cell phones like i'm on my cell phone now praying always on their cell phones lord god instead of engaging with other people lord god get us out of that bondage that we will pay more attention to our surroundings that we'll pay more attention to each other that our eyes will not be glued on the electronics father in the mighty name of jesus and lord god when we do use it that we use it for your honor and your glory lord god may we not you know we are in this world but we are not of this world hallelujah we are uh, um in the we are in the mix with god we are god's children so we are in heavenly our treasures are heavenly bound our thoughts are heavenly bound our heart is heavenly bound hallelujah we're building things uh um, eternal in the name of jesus hallelujah and i'm not saying there's anything wrong with those things in the natural because we are in the natural but let's not make these things our God. Our telephones should not be our God. Our television, old school, say hella vision. That is not your God. The computers are not your God. The electronics, not your God. Any robots, the AI is not your God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, glory, glory, glory. Hallelujah. Let's put the great I am where he belongs. He is first and foremost, and he is the most important in our lives. Without God, we can do nothing. As I said, we are focusing on not being lukewarm Christians. We are focusing on renewing ourselves that we will be in in the image of God. He created us in his image. But it is up to us to comply with that. You know Eve. She got out of God's image. When she decided to disobey God. Now yes you still have certain things. That you can do as God has. Because he did create us. But just imagine if you're in his will if you're obeying him if you're trusting him if you're walking by the spirit and you're operating in kingdom authority and power hallelujah hallelujah praise god hallelujah so we thank god on this evening this evening this morning we thank god on today hallelujah hallelujah glory 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 to the lord I praise God for each and every one of you. I thank God for everyone that's listening and that is um, always showing love on my channel. God bless you. I have more things to come. I'm getting to wrap. It'll probably be starting um, probably by next year. But trust and believe, you know, things are going to switch up a little bit. Okay. Okay, all right, all right. God bless you all. And you know what? Before I end this prayer, because I'm actually about to pray on my Facebook, before I end this prayer, if there is anyone who wants to receive Jesus as Lord and Savior, repeat this prayer after me. Dear Lord Jesus, I know that I'm a sinner. And I ask for your forgiveness. I believe you died on the cross for my sins and rose again from the dead on the third day. I turn from my sins and invite you to come into my heart and come into my life. I want to trust you as my Lord and Savior. I want to receive you as my Lord and Savior. Hallelujah. Praise God. Go to a Pentecostal church. Get water baptized. Read the Bible every day. Say yes to God every day. Say no to the world, the flesh, and the devil, and live for Jesus Christ. I love you all.